Spoon gonna tell you what is happening in Liberia. Spoon gonna tell you what is happening in Morovia. Spoon gonna tell you what is happening in Africa. Africa. Just to the spoon, oh, to the spoon you ain't know. Did the children cry for starvation just to the spoon? You want to get a news update, my brother, to the spoon. You want to know what is happening, my brother, to the spoon. Politicians want to make their decision just to the spoon. You want to know what happening in the ministry to the spoon. Yeah, yeah, to the spoon. Yeah, 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 to the spoon. You from Fonjema, Maryland, to the spoon. Yeah, 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 to the spoon. If you eat kebab, regular, my brother, to the spoon. You got a spoon TV, you got a spoon radio, to the spoon. Yeah, 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 two to spoon. You want to get a news update, two to spoon. What, 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 yeah, Rastafara. Kilibaba, 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 kilibaba. You got a spoon TV, you got a spoon radio, two to spoon. Okay, folks, um, time check here in Liberia is one minute after 8 p.m. Today is Sunday the 14th day of april 2024 wherever it is you watching us from we love to say welcome to you um wherever it is you listening to us uh, from and via our different radio frequencies and services we love to say uh, welcome to you as well um something terrible is happening as we speak uh, we're getting live images from the home of the speaker of the house of representatives honorable jonathan fonati kofa um, that his home is being gutted by an inferno, very, 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 very serious fire outbreak there at the home of the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Councillor Jonathan Fonati Kofa. Uh, so our team is responding as we speak, but we do have the footage coming in. Uh, I do see a fire truck from the Liberia National Fire Service. This is, this is terrible. This is terrible. Um, this is seriously terrible. Um, see you. Pleasant afternoon to you, sir. Yeah, seriously, Diamond. You see, uh, thank God that we do the God can bless somebody. But we have to pause. Uh, I hope our guys can get on the scene ASAP because we have to bring this story life. A lot of people, a lot of people actually, I don't think folks know what is going on, Diamond. I don't think they know what's going on. So where are we right now? Uh, how far is uh, is your reporter? Yeah, they they're currently in route. Um, you know these things happen. They don't give you a a timestamp as to when they will happen, but they're in route. They will be there in less than ten minutes. So let's listen to this guy. Let's listen to this gentleman. Everybody's gathering. Everyone gathering as to what is oh, happening. You can see the um, this is the room, and if I have entered in a room, and the room is not far from. The room is not far from the the current wild, and the fire is so hard from the back because it started from the back. As you can, I don't know how, I cannot zoom. But but the, the room is on fire. I'm afraid because I'm not a professional person to do this, but uh, I'm trying my best, and my life is also a race even being near this thing. That's why you see I'm trying. Right right at this place, you can see there's a transformer. And if, uh, something about it has closed or so, we don't even know. But it's, it's, the fire is so high right now. The fire is so high. Fire, the first fire truck team, no, fire truck team are first and uh, the first water got finished. The water got finished, the brand new one. So if they can bust the back, I think that's what they're trying to do. But so, it's, it's, Dama, do you know this place? The, the fire, do you know the fire, tea house? Do you know the, the location? Says, yeah, yeah, yes, I do. I know the location is. Uh, uh, one minute, let me let me mute the audio uh, to answer you. Yeah, so I know the I know the rest the speaker's residence is just um, opposite the rehab residence of President. We are the junction 
the leading to the rehab residence of President Weah. It's just opposite there. Um, it's a beautiful structure. Seeing it go up in flames, you know, it's, it's, it's really hot, drenching at this moment. Whatever the status of a property is. Um, once is, you this a, is this the fire. property they call the White House? Yes. Yes. Wow. Um, in there, you have a swimming pool. It's a nice structure. Yeah. It's a, it's a really nice structure. And uh, to see it up in flames, this is the third most powerful man in the country. We had the same incidents with um, Senator Sir Joseph's residence. And today that place is cornered off. You know, it, it burned down completely. And you're seeing this happening to the speaker. I, of, so of I understand we are, we are feeling off. We are feeling off of, of, of another individual until Spoon gets there. But you see, mm -hmm. you see four or five different transformer line, right? And poles. Yeah, so I don't know if the speaker has got a dedicated transformer. From what I'm looking at from the wire, you can see that that is a dedicated transformer. Um, the wire, the, the bundle cable you see is going straight to his, to his residence. So that is a dedicated transformer. But you have transformers all around the rehab belt there. But that transformer looks like a dedicated one. So let me listen in for a bit because I, I know you said the guy's almost there. Let's just listen in for a bit. Okay, let me restore the audio. Do we have an audio, Jamal? Yeah. You're in heaven right now. Oh my God. This is something. This is the country needs prayer. That just because because Palanti Kofa will not be his house with any type of wire. He used we rarely spend all this house. So even if it's foreign, it can be from the wires. This, this is something serious. This is something that the country needs prayer. And currently, I think the party the speaker has come or somebody else. He's here. As you can see, he's walking. Uh, no, and it's not him. I think yes, he's seeing it. He's here in person, and he's seeing it now. He he just came and said, uh, okay. I, I know the moment. And he's seeing it now. This property is not easy. I, I don't know. No, it's somebody else. He's not the one. So if the speaker is there, wow. all the place black and the smoke started from the back. So even when we're raising awareness, said nobody could enter in. The smoke started. Ever since. Yes, I think we can. Yeah, the smoke was so heavy, and we started telling people to chop fire service. The fire, the fire, fire service now at the back, and this is so bad. Yeah, well, that's that. Nobody, they, 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 yeah, I don't so know. They're trying, they, they're still turning around. Dama oh. tried, Dama tried. I don't know what they're still turning around. This is bad. Try our report away. They were not able to reach the end. And if you are, when they were, when they came, my friend, if if the fire was going to be off from upstairs, things that are downstairs would have been safe. But I think I think by now the fire reached downstairs. This is not about Nabil. This thing is not political. This is something this is a huge loss. This is not politi political. This is a huge loss. This is huge. This is oh my god, this is bad. This is so bad. As you can see, people are calling some of the workers who I know are friends. I'm seeing them so distressed right now. This is the cook for Kalaki Kopa. She just passed the The fire service car is running. I think what I think the front, I think at, they're not wasting water. They are not wasting water. The people have grouped too much, they're not even getting the fire service. Chance for even work. They're not, they're, they're telling, talking how the water can kill, but the night be giving the people chase. You can hear things that are exploded. It's so bad. This is so sad. This is really sad. That one, when I'm there, this, we're always helping the people. I said, if I walk around, you see people cry because be at that same. this is somebody who every day. Do you have, work, do you have magic in the studio, Dama? I don't know. Yes, magic. Is bad. Yeah. It is terrible. Can magic get on back and go there as quick too? Uh, it's bad. I don't know what else to say. I'll continue this prayer.
wow this is this is something demo this is and the fire truck are not <laughs> what are they doing demo what are you seeing them doing what what was your observation well um, i mean you myself look at the same thing anyway but i'm not seeing yeah. anything they are doing so far uh, the, the where the the gentleman doing the recording courtesy to him you know um the angle that he's standing is difficult to see um what the fire service folks are doing i heard him say they're trying to fight the inferno from the back of the house but he's he's, he's a bit far and i see two fire engines he's a bit far and because of that it's difficult to tell what their intervention is i'm trying to get in contact with our teams because i dispatched two persons and I'm unable at this moment, so I'm still making those calls to make sure where they are um, at this moment. They should okay, be. Okay, so yeah, so go ahead, give a volume, uh, give us some a uh, 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 volume, let audio, let go ahead, and then we will wait. He just arrived also too. I think I think he just arrived. I think this is a score ball. How you doing, bro? This is a score ball. The speaker, the speaker, score ball just came. I, I think this is. I think this is his petrol. This is the speaker's car. Um, the speaker is now in front of the president's area. He just arrived, and I'm seeing people. People are just people are just on top of him right now. I'm going to where he is. I don't know. I think they are carrying that speaker. I think he went to my place. It's, this is bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. This is serious. The, the speaker is now going to the president's place, the former president's fence. He's, he, they, they are now carrying. They are now carrying. Oh, okay. That, that's president. That's our former president, George Biden. We are just here. He's going in his house. Why? He's just across the speaker's, the, the, the speaker's house. And our fanatic profile place is on fire. Um, it's very burning for the past hour now. Oh, my God. I'm a, uh, this place is for comedy, but this is so serious, so I had to just off the LEC in order to save the transformer from uh, at first the, 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 the fire started with with the current when the current came when the current came the fire came and um I was here to, to, to pick it up and this is bad this is so bad. They're now bringing water up. I think they're trying to, I don't know what they are doing right now, but um, it's bad. It's bad. As you can see, as you can see, this thing, they are telling people to leave from here. I have to go there because I'm not, a fire service agent or a worker, but people were not listening. So I'm gonna carry you guys to the back to where you coming from. Come in. Try to go get me water. I'm testing. Say one of my weather, my old boys want to do the first one and get me water. This is so bad. It started a fresh one. So bombing bottle water. Yeah, yeah, you know, you want to get water. So yeah, um this is bad. As you can see, this is so terrible. It's not about politics. This is a, somebody's father's house. It's being burned down to ashes. And this is very bad. When I, when I started this live, I first... When I started, I first, the fire was just smoke. At that time, it was just smoke. The disaster was just smoke. And now... And Water. Yeah, wasting water for the repair. You know, like rest kind of water. That's the best thing to do. Not a waste water, so they put the clear up. But now they put a lot of abuse. The fire is burning. And uh, I need to drink. These are people standing here. That's why. I'm going to say, from, uh, this is, this is, is close. Give me water, let me drink. Open it for me, please. Open it for me, please. I'm sick. 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 I
Okay, I mean, it's here. Oh, me, I like LEC. I like LEC. No. I like LEC or what? Yes. This is, this is, this is, I mean, it was Sir Joseph. LEC, I'm going to go. LEC, I'm going Yeah? It was Sir Joseph. Few weeks back. LEC, I'm going to break up. So, um, See, the house is burning to the ground. Stay tall. The house is burning to the ground. Oh, yeah. Sir Joseph, a few weeks back. Oh, God. The the is the... Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm sick, Stanton. I'm sick. I'm sick. A few weeks back, it was Sir Joseph. We have our guys going to be on the scene pretty soon. But Uncle Sam, man, what's going on? Stand up, I don't understand. I don't know. I mean, I've never, I never been this sick. Man, I mean, like completely break down like this in a long time. Fonati is my friend. Okay, you always think that to wear myself clothes that Fonati and myself, that my boy there, my brother, that my boy. That is my dude. Yeah. And for this to happen, I, I did call his uh one of his uh assistants who were both crying on the phone just now. I mean, I'm, I'm totally, I'm, I'm broken down. I'm completely broken down. Broken down, man. I mean, that is a beautiful house, man, Stanton. That's a beautiful house. And they said they call it the White House? Yeah, it, it, it's a beautiful house. That man, that man works very hard. He's done extremely well for himself, you know, and just like, I mean, for this to happen to him, it's, it, is, it, is, it, is, it, is, it is so tragic. It, it is very tragic, Stanton. I mean, we need to do something. I don't know. I mean, we all got to just get together as Liberians and solve our problem and work together. Forget well, about it, it, again. Over though we don't know, and I really don't want to speculate, Uncle Sam. We don't know, mm -hmm. right? But the sense that from one individual to another, one family to another, lawmakers getting involved, permanent Liberians, the poor yeah. people. Yeah. Everybody just like what's it, going it, on, it, man? It, it's, a, it's an epidemic. It, what I mean? So, so, so they have to find out the what the causes of these fires are. Okay, because it's like it's going. It's like an epidemic. You know, it's it's an it's an epidemic. I mean, you know, I mean, I, I, I've never seen anything like this in my life before. Never, never in my life to see. They kind of think every day, and, and it's, it's from, from the people to the bottom, from the people to the top, you know? It, 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 is, it, it is very worrisome, most Stanton. They got a I mean, you're a good thing about a house. That's a beautiful house, though. It's a, it's I mean. like, man, I, I would have to have breakfast so many mornings, man. You know, I just, you know, that feel like didn't see him. I would leave my my place in the morning, go to eat and have breakfast, eat my quicker oats with him. Very good man, man. Very good man. I mean, well loved, well loved, good to his neighbors, you know, very, I mean, extremely generous man, extremely brilliant man, nice family, oh my God, you know, I mean, it's just his wife, Tama, oh my God, you know, beautiful, beautiful wife and family, man, it's just, it is, it is, this, this is sad, this is beyond sad, Stanton, this is beyond sad, I mean, I'm just like, I mean, I broke down in tears, man, broke down. Wow. Yeah, I, yeah, I ran. I ran to my wife. She knows what I very well. She said, like, she got her hand up too. I mean, you know, it's just like, oh my god, you know. And that's a that's a big house. I'm it's a saying. big, that's beautiful a big, house. He took his time to build house. a house. Yeah, he took his time to build a house. That's a big home. house, man. That's a nice house. Look at the house. It's on fire, and they, they can't. They can't. They, they, I mean, that, that house. Yeah, yeah. It. it went into the no. ground. Yeah, nothing. I mean, we started. We started the show uh, twenty minutes ago. It, the fire was at the back, though. But I know how, how close the fire fire have come to the front to the yeah. main entrance. Yeah, but I mean, the thing is like, I mean, I mean, I mean, I want no no politics about no fire service or all that kind of thing there, you know. But I mean, this is this is just something that it's just it's it's happening too often. They gotta. We really got to bring, you know, some people who understand this thing here, the electric or the electrical system or what a LEC or what are the generator or something. We got to 
go to the bottom of this because this I'm I'm a friend because I moved to my house in June. Okay, I moved to my house in June in in in, in Gate Town. Okay, and I you know and I'm and I'm and I'm really worried now whether I should even get LEC. You know. But to find out because I mean at my age, man, you know, but I blame the day down with the iron door closed at night, fire break out there, it will, it will consume me, you know. Oh man, it's 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 bad, it's very, very bad. I mean, the, look at the, the house is burning, 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 burning. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh, oh my god. Oh my God! Oh my God! It's, it's, it looks tantrum, man. I don't, I don't, I really don't know, my brother. I really don't know something. And, and when I heard it, when I heard, it, I was on the phone call. Somebody said, "Stand up, check it out. Fonati House is on fire." And I said, "No, you're kidding me." He said, "Yeah, Fonati House is on fire." I said, "Let me just go live. Let people see this. You know, because this is this is something. But it's not because it, 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 it's it, it's because of something that is happening so often in the country now." It is. It's, it's an it's epidemic in every corner. Yeah, it's an epidemic. It's an it's epidemic. It's not because of Fonati. Yeah, it's yeah. just happening. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, Ozinsha, a mansion of Fonati House, Sir Joseph resident, he was stuck in it. Mm -hmm. well, Uncle Sam, I mean, is this the new Liberia? I mean, we're not putting politics in this, but. This seems to be the new norm, you know? But the sense stands on. We need to hold together and try to get on what is behind this thing. Stand on. This is it's an epidemic. If we need to get if we need to get our best collaborative firefighters around the world in the United States, different states, all over the world, get them, put them together. And the electrical engineers and team there, let them find out what this, what the fires are coming from, so we can solve it. Because if not, my brother, it will it, it, it will become people, people lives, people lives, people lives, man. Yeah? And imagine, you know, to make the kind of investment. Okay. I and see then, that we have, I see that we have spoon on the scene, so we we'll get a group fee. But I want to say thanks to the gentleman that was running this. From his end, and I think Dama going to bring us in now. But Spoon, Dama, can you do that? The viewers waiting, please. Uh, yes, Spoon sir, is yes, I'm, I'm trying to do. I'm trying to bring us in from from Spoon, the president comedian. He was the one we are taking feed from. We want to tell him thank you. Yeah, um, Uncle please, Sam, this this seems to be like washing from our own life here. Now, as you can see, Spoon it's is going with it. It's going down. It's going down. It's going down. It's going down. The fire service has not done anything yet about it. They are here, they are setting up. But as you can see, um, this is a simple witness. The first portion of the building, that is the upper floor, is completely destroyed by the fire. The second um, portion of the business has got the fire now. I can say for no fact that everyone is outside of the building. It's too late to um to save. Oh, said, look at that building. Yeah. Look at that building. Oh, said. That is that and is. And I'm not actually carrying it now because this is the spoon tree. But look at the entire structure, the full view. What you said? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, do we have any words from the speaker? Was he in the house? I mean, anybody? Dami, what are we getting? Can you ask her? So, um, Theo, I'm still trying to get in this question. Do you want to there? Okay. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, yeah. Sir, 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 every one of them, they let us more information. Uh, uh, I hear people say LDC, LDC, LDC. What do you think? Uh, well, because, because that has been, that has been the use of the phantom. It happened, it not happening with the kind of food that is happening now. LDC, power surge, the rules. I've seen it burn several rooms, but this is becoming this is becoming more regular. Okay, becoming more regular, more regular. I mean, I've seen it a few times during my days in Liberia, but now this is just getting too, 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 too rampant, too rampant, too rampant. 
Yeah, now the house gone. Yeah, the house gone. The house is gone. Yeah, the house is gone. The house is gone. But besides the 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 the, the fire damage, the smoke, the smoke. The smoke, okay. Yes, Look at that thing, yeah. The, the house is burning. Oh my god, it's just it's, 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 it's so sad. So sad, so sad, man. It's, it is this is this is really oh my god. Yeah. As you can see, okay. that house, that house is gone, it finished. Look at that big, big mansion. They are trying Look what's happening, Uncle Sam with Labira right now. What is going on? It was Sir Joseph a few weeks back. So Joseph got stuck in his house. They never stuck him out. He nearly died. And we are talking about the speaker. Yeah, yeah. And, 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 and take politics out of this. This, where we find ourselves now, it, it's a scary terrain. Yeah, it is. It's scary. It is. Yeah, yeah. You know, and, and we, we got right now it's 8 25 in Liberia, it's in the night. Imagine family sleeping so I, and fire got in their got, got, got in their homes, Uncle Sam. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, yes, thank you. I mean, and and and, and, and they try to put it out, you know, they the do not they do they seem to be doing their, their best. I see I see fire holes there with you know. I see them. They, they had to go back two times for 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 water, yeah. right? Yeah. And they trying to put it up, but the house is done. Yeah. That thing is done. Yeah, it's done. Yeah, yeah. That property gone. Yeah, yeah. I, I I'm going to bring in Mohammed back. I'm going to bring him back. He almost there. I'm going. To, we have so many of our reporters on the scene. We'll be flipping off, guys. Follow us and just let's see exactly. So let's get this the to the end. Hello. So we are here. This is cool. TV. Yeah. Coming to you live. You know the cause of this fire in Liberia from a little man from the view. Well, what are the cause? What do you think? Ha uh, 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 yeah, what's happening? Why you gotta be fast, so I'm live on the show. You gotta be fast. Center, number one, we are not used to 220. Number two, the wiring of the burial homes in Liberia is not conducive. If there will be any other way, the 220 they provide us, we used to one, 110, 120. So the only best way for us, because we are not trained in fire. The Thank you. I have to go back. I have to go back because they share us another portion. Thank you. One ten, one twenty. Thank you. Uh, uh, Damas, uh, just go ahead. Give an order. Uh, 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 Hello, my name is Dennis Dixon, bringing you live coverage from the house of the speaker. That has caused the fire, according to um, community dwellers, eyewitnesses. The fire started about around 6 p.m. Um, and they are being complaining about that. That's the, the water is being pumped. The building. The fire service are trying their best to ensure that they can cut off this fire. Grandma, have you made connection for us to talk to the reporter? Uh, Uncle Sam, you've been in the house before. Can you tell us what you say? Which entrance? Okay, so, give us some description? so it, it it looked like to me it would be like the the entrance from the front on the rehab road side. Okay, and then yeah, and I, I think the uh, the fire truck is now. I think it's in the yard, and on the left hand side there you see the garage. You can go through the garage to go into the house to the uh, the ground floor. And you, or you can also go straight to the front and go straight to the ground floor, okay? And the living quarters are up upstairs. He has his he has his office downstairs, in the you know the uh, living room, dining room, and the kitchen. You know, it's all it's all it's all downstairs. But the uh, living quarters are upstairs. Okay, so the fire truck they're trying the best, of course. 
they are trying their best. We just need confirmation as to the word about, about the speaker on Kusen. Are you getting any information concerning yeah. the speaker and, then, and his family? And Paul, and they call Gibson, right? Okay, uh, Gibson is just like his special assistant, you know, like his, uh, you know, like a guy who does his running, you know? And I call him, and he was like in, in complete tears. I mean, and I, I, I broke down in tears myself too, you know? So I couldn't speak to him for more than like 30, 30 seconds, and he had to go, you know? And I didn't, I didn't even get an opportunity to ask where Fonati is right now, but I'm sure he's safe. But I'm, I mean, I can just imagine the mental anguish he's undergoing right now, his family, oh my God, I just, oh, phew, this is just, it's, this is terrible. This is terrible, terrible, terrible. Yeah, terrible. I, would just, I mean, the structure can be up, but tell me why that thing is all burned in, Uncle Sam. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And, and, and the fire is still, is, is still, is still on, and it looks like the, the a fire truck people, I don't see water going there again. It looks like probably they have run out of water again. The water going again. The water gone. Yeah. The water I gone. They, I think they run out of water. Yeah. I mean, you know, yeah. No, no, this is this is this is very serious, uh, uh Stan. This is very, very serious, man. Oh pop is this is this is oh my god. This is oh whew. this is did really, really bad. Really, really bad. Yeah, and just I mean, this is the time that you know uh, God, you know, uh, you know, has to come and just basically touch the touch, touch the heart to to guide them in this time. You know? I, I just I just got a phone call, Uncle Sam. The speaker and his family are okay. I mm -hmm. just got a phone call from one of the closest friends who spoke to them. Great the speaker and the, and his family, the wife, they're all okay. Thank God. Uh, that's the biggest good news so far, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, and I believe that at the appropriate time, uh, the speaker will speak on this issue. Uh, but uh, I just spoke to one of the closest friends of the speaker, the the, the 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 friends of one of the representatives, a friend to the speaker and his wife. Uh, mm -hmm. Just said that the speaker and his wife and his family they are all okay. Uh, so the. I mean, the folks are going to the same Uncle Sam. Folks are going there right now mm -hmm. just to make sure that uh, yeah. they can see the speaker. But we can announce, folks, that the speaker of Jay Fodanti Kofa, his wife and family, they are all okay. Uh, yes, indeed, this is speaker of Kofa property. Uh, what you see in live is uh, the liberal speaker, Jay Fodanti Kofa, rehab resident, uh, which is on fire currently is on fire uncle sam uncle sam that's a beautiful news to hear that i mean the oh, fire yeah. is oh, oh absolutely that's the that's the most important news that i mean uh no loss of life the speaker is okay his wife is okay the family is okay uh properties can be rebuilt but life cannot be rebuilt so to thank right. god for that that is that is the best news that coming out of this the best best news and uh i i just want to just basically you know uh i mean uh, reach out to the family, which I would do, you know, directly. But just in this public manner, I would like to really, you know, uh, my heartfelt, just, yeah, mean, you know, uh, sorry, okay. Norma, and I mean, we hope and pray that, you know, uh, you know, God can bless him so that he can be able to, like, you know, do whatever he can to, you know, recoup the losses that he sustained today. Because this is this is this is a huge loss for a young. Yes. It is. Yeah, I mean, that's not a small building either. It yeah. is. So you have Dennis on the line. Dennis yes. Nipson doing the live coverage for us. Thank you. Bring her on. Yeah. So Dennis, you you live in your life and another life. Um, tell us, did did they take out anybody from the house? Did you see them? You know, taking people from within the house, or what have you noticed since you've been there? Okay. Thank you, Damon. Um. When I arrived on the scene, um, the speaker and all others who are in the house were taken out of the house. I saw the speaker um, walking along the road, along the, the premises of his house, where a lot of people were behind him. Others who are part of his um, residence were also out as well. And what they were trying to do is to remove all of the items from the house because the fire started um, right. top part of the building. The building is a duplex 
So the duplex from the top of the fire flow is where the fire started from. Currently, the down flow, there's no fire yet. But the compartment of the duplex, the first one has been brought up by fire, completely destroyed, burned down. Mm. It's the second one now that has started um, the fire. Currently, the fire service is trying to, you know, um, fulfill the spread of the fire. But I think the the building is a huge building, a huge property that is actually difficult for them. But they are trying their best. Currently, the fire is starting from the other compartment of the duplex. But I can tell you for one fact is the building has been destroyed from the top floor. Hmm. You said you saw the speaker and yeah. some yeah. portions yeah. of the house taking out. Uh, how many persons, if you did a head count, and what, what are eyewitnesses saying? What are the community dwellers saying as to on when this fire started, this fire outbreak started here at the speaker's residence? Okay, so for now, because of the situation, you know it's an incident, so I won't be able to give you the explanation or the correct, um, you know, number of, as to all those who have seen. But I have seen um, those who work with the speaker have seen several of them as well trying to remove um, documents and all of those things that perhaps were in the house, some of the items that were in the house. And according to the bar center, the eyewitnesses or neighbors, they said the fire started um, around 6 p.m. today. When, it, according to them, it is due to LEC, um, the current situation. But it started gradually around 6 p.m. And now the crowd is out here looking and they are, you know, actually angry with the the fire service that why they are not moving with speed and all of that. See you. Also, uh, yeah, can she hear us though? Can you hear me? What's her name again? Denise, Denise I'll, I'll relay whatever question you have to her. No, I mean, if she can hear us, that's fine. Uh, the, when the guys get on the scene, we can talk to them. Uh, if she, if she, I mean, let's she just do more coverage yet. Let's just see if she can get closer. You know, let that. Yeah, Dennis, Dennis one, one last question before, 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 before we let go of you to continue your live coverage. Um, the speaker and those who were evacuated from the house, um, did they come to see the fire? You know, in progress, or they were in the house when the fire started and they had to be rescued because they could have come to see what was happening and go back due to safety, or they were within and then they were rescued to come and uh, taken out of the house. Which one? So that is why I'm going to to verify because when the situation happened, everyone was like, the speaker house is on fire and we watched on the scene. When we watched on the scene, it was a scene that everyone was kind of disturbed. So they were coming in and out. So I didn't see whether the speaker was in the house and he, you know, got rescued from the house. Until I then, we asked a question. Um, that was a settle with the situation. Then I can try to speak to you know um, the relevant authority or somebody that will give the, the statement from the speaker to know whether he was in the house when it happened. Okay. Right. Let, me ask, let me ask a question. It's very it's very important. Uh, so so Denise, give us exact location of speaker for that Tikofa resident. This building, folks that don't know where 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 we where where this building located. So help us. Well, where is it located? So where, where where is the speaker's residence located? The building that is currently the on fire. The speaker of um resident is located in the rehab community, right opposite former president George Weir House, the house that he, he has in the rehab, where he was um dwelling before moving to the Sinkard um residence. So that's where we are in the rehab community. Just is um that's the stone throw from the house of the president. President Joseph Walker. Let me, let me ask. Let me ask, sir. Do you enter the the hash gate that pres, former president built? Uh, built. No. Uh, you don't go into that gate. He's no, outside it's, of it's, that gate, right? It's opposite that. Yeah. It's opposite the park that has the oh, welcome sign. Outside, outside of the gate, he's not in line. the gate. Yeah, no, it's not. It's uh, not within. Here. Okay, so I so is she currently in the compound? <laughs> Denise, from the footage, um, you you in the compound, right? You're not outside looking in. You're in the actual compound, right? Yeah, yes, I'm I'm in the compound currently. They allow the um, press to come in. They allow the press to come in. I'm in the the fence currently, as you can see. 
So, um, what you see from the live coverage, we are in the paint, viewing the, view the entire property. Mm. So, yes. Denise, we are seeing so, fire. It is Give us from the top, you have the, the offset of the duplex. So, the entire place is where the fire started from. So, it has burned completely, it has been destroyed. It's only perhaps the down floor that is um, untouched. The fire has not spread to that part. Mm. But from the top of the building, the entire floor, the top floor has been destroyed by the fire. Denise, do you think do you think any part of this property still okay or the entire house is consumed by fire, Denise? Tell us what you are saying. So from what you said and what, what you're showing us, Denise, it's a duplex. Um, but can a portion of this property be salvaged? Can a portion be saved? Or the entire building has been gutted? Whether a portion of the building can be refurbished? No, what a portion of Yeah, or the building is totally burned. Okay, you can... There's not to be no areas of sophisticated building. I can let me put it that way. It is a well constructed um property. So what happened is the fire from the roof of the building, mm. the fire burned the top part of the building. Mm -hmm. The structure is standing for the top of the building, the roof of the building, because of the, the metals being that then used. So the fire burned from the top and into the building. Mm. So within the building. That's where the fire is, the fire destroyed. But the lower floor and the structure itself has not got it down because it's a very strong um, constructed building. Okay. All right. So be careful. It's fire. Oh, we're talking about. I know you're going around with a whole small. I got two other questions, uh, if you can. And, and then uh, okay. Officer and, and, and Glenny is here with us as well. Glenny. You came by way of the front. Have you gone to the back? Can you give us some description? If you can, be safe there. What is happening around the property? Dennis, I can see you moving by the pool side and that is making your way to the back of the building. Uh, uh, so tell us, is this the back view of the building? Yes, this is the back view. This is the back view of the building where they have the swimming pool. Mm -hmm. Or where they have the swimming pool. Be careful, Mama. The pool water, everything is splashing and then be careful. They're using, they're using the pool water. That's a smart move, too. Yeah, they're using the pool water. Be careful, be careful. Be careful so they are please. using the water from the pool to quench the fire. Sorry, I have to leave because this, this area is actually. Yeah, be careful, Mama. Yeah, yes. thank you. All right, thank you. Uh, all right, thank you. So, Uncle Sam, uh, Lenny, uh, so we're going to keep it going like this. Uh, Damo, do you have your other reporters on the scene yet? Yes, um, I'll connect with uh, with uh, Cholo Play and Nelson is almost there. Uh, but from what we're looking at is the back of the building, the pool side. Yeah, they're using yeah. the pool. Uncle Sam, talk to me, man. Uh, Glenny, welcome. This, this is just one of our... Hey, you know, a breaking news event. We're about to do God can bless anybody, but see what we see here. San Jose yesterday, Fanatico for today, thousands of Liberians' house got burned, people died. But thank God today, Fanatico and his family, they are safe. San Jose and his family are safe. Uh, Uncle Sam, talk to me, then we go to Glenny. You are muted, Uncle Sam. It is one of these situations that requires a lot of soul searching. Eh? And I mean, some great degree of seriousness, okay? Because this cannot go on like this, you know? We have to, they have to investigate the root causes or the, the root cause or causes of these fires. They have to put a team together and they have to put the resources to, I mean, to just basically, because this is this is an epidemic, Stanton. This is not this is not uh, restricted to any neighborhood. It's not restricted to any social economic background. It cuts across. I mean, you saw the fire the other day in West Point. You see it in Bonnersville. You see it all over yeah. the place. You know, 
And they really need to do something as quickly as possible. Uh, if it's a power surge from LEC, they need to put in safety measures that a lot of, they, we just, they just have to investigate this because this is, this is going beyond, it's, it's, it's just going beyond Stanton. And, and that's all I can say. And then for the sake of Fanati and his family, I just uh, wish them well. I pray for him, you know, and thank God they are safe. And I, I just hope and pray that, you know, God can, you know, um, uh, provide whatever so he can be whole. Because right now, that look, it looks very bad. And the fire is still on. It's just, it doesn't appear like there's a capacity of the fire service or the neighbor. I see the neighbors using buckets. I mean, this is 20th century, 21st century. People are using buckets to put up fire. This, this shouldn't be happening in Liberia. This is, this is bad. This is extremely bad. Lady, yeah, hello, Stanton. This is uh, I was driving when I when I switched and I watched this. Mm -hmm. I just got home. It's it's you want you don't want to wish this on anyone. This is I agree with Uncle Sam. This is a serious pandemic in the country. Something has to happen. There's and it can't just always be that it's a, it's an electrical problem. There's too many of these fires that have gone on in recent times to so important people in the in the government. That we can't just say, oh, the LEC problem, or it's because an electrical problem. This is so sad. It is so so sad. We shouldn't want it to want to wish this on anyone. This is just terrible. If it's an arson that's going on, it's if, if there's someone in there that's setting on these fires, the government really does need to do an do an in-depth investigation. But this cannot happen, continue to happen. Not only that, on the other side, it's like some of us just got her up with fire and we are not even able to salvage it. So what 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 end of the spectrum are we gonna work on fixing? Is either we have a, a, fi a good fire fire service system or we have a way of investigating why we're having all of these fires in Liberia. This is this is I mean, how can I even say it's an electrical problem? This house has been there for a while now. So what really happened? Uh, I am so sorry to the speaker and his family. Uh, just this is just, it just saddens me. And I was like, as tired as I am, I just I had to come on because it's just terrible. It's just terrible. I, I, I am, thank you, Blandy. Thank you, uh, uh, like you said. I, I'm just, I'm just, I, I don't know what else to say. Okay. I, imagine when we had Sir Joseph, you know, going through. You're safe, me. I would die. I would die. I would die. And I had to bust the window to get him out. Imagine Fulati Kofa preparing to go to work tomorrow. Yes. Where everything that is on his plate. So, no, that, this is serious. Take politics out of this. I, I don't know. Whether somebody doing this thing or whether it's LDC yes. or. It, it, I don't know, but. It, it, a serious investigation need to take place. Yeah. What yeah. happened to the what happened to the poor people in Brazil that Z house? Look at this mansion. Look at this building. I'm I, I thank God we are carrying the life. Thank God we're telling folks. Everything on the table. Rich poor. Oh yeah. Strong yeah. minded, everything, every. Everywhere and nobody home safe in Liberia. Nobody home safe. Yeah. Yeah. And, and 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 it is very worrisome to me, Stanton. I'm 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 rehabbing my house on the old road there. You know, uh, about to move in it, and I went to get my meter. I sent them to get my meter from LEC. It's taken forever. Been like about a month and a half now. Haven't gotten my meter yet. You know, um, but I'm 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 having second guess about LEC. Maybe I just live on a on a tiger generator, you know, and 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 don't have a lot of appliances or something because I mean this this is I mean uh I mean I just feel very bad for 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 Nati, you know, and I just hope he can overcome it. You know, this is this is this is a serious loss. It's a serious loss. Oh, that's a, that's a, a big loss. loss. A terrible that's, loss. Yeah, that's, that's a, a big, big loss. loss. It's a big loss. It's a big loss. Oh, it's, a big, big, big it's a big, big, big loss. It's a big loss. And you know, then it brings into you know question about all of the institutional things that a country need. You know, because of this in America. We will profit for it because the insurance company will pay for it. They will pay for the dwelling. 
and they will give him a place to stay and all of that. So I don't know what are the, the insurance in Liberia, whether the house is insured, what are, you know, I mean, there's just, there's just too many unanswered questions, you know? But you know, in America, the, the house will be insured and and and, and they, will, they, will, they will make him whole, but whether the, what are the, the the house had insurance and whether the insurance people there, the company has the capacity, ability to even pay the claim. Even if he had insurance, can it pay the claim? Because because that claim would be a huge claim, a serious huge claim. Uh, Granny, uh, we listen. I, I'm out of words here because this is like an ongoing stuff, Granny. This is like. Every day. Damo, who do we have? I've seen that Nelson is coming on, right? Yeah, so we have Nelson as well. Nelson is, is live um, from within the compound of the speaker. Uh, so let's see if we can get some audio from him. Uh, we'll okay. Denise, Denise's feed. Yeah, so Nelson, can I unmute your microphone? Please unmute your microphone, Nelson, so that we can talk to you for a bit. So while Nelson is trying to unmute his microphone, we'll keep Denise's feed there. Nelson, please unmute your microphone, sir. This is so sad. It's so sad. Nelson, kindly unmute your microphone. I, I have no words because this is bad for everything. It's, it's just really, really bad. It's so, so sad. It's so, it, so sad. Can you tell Dennis to tell him, um, Adamo? I mean, and, and you know, Stanton, you can see more smoke and, and the embers from the smoke. It's not Uncle Sam. Uncle Sam, let me interrupt you. The fire truck not helping. No, 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 it's not. It's not. No, it's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. So, uh, this is where we no, are. No, what I'm saying, what I'm saying, even if they were to put it up, they were to put a fire out, right? Yeah. The embers and the, and the, and, and the smoke to also, I mean, restart the fire. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Also, even the people that are in close proximity, I mean, they should also be careful. I mean, yeah. this is let, bring in, let, let me bring in the reporter. Then we'll go ahead and bring Nelson in. Nelson, are you hearing us, sir? Nelson? So Nelson seems to be having a uh, technical problem. That was fine. Jesus. Hear me? Nelson, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Diamond, I can hear you. Are you there? Can you hear me? Yeah, loud and clear. So, um, where, where, where currently are you, sir? But don't so, put it um, now. Now, I am uh, standing right before the residence of the speaker, Councillor J. Fonati Kofa. As you see right on the screen here, Diamond, Liberians are trooped in here following this information about the home of the speaker uh, being on fire. And uh, there's a huge presence of firefighters here. The Liberia National Fire Service got on the scene, according to eyewitnesses, some of whom I've spoken with, the Liberia National Fire Service was able to get on the scene, but still they could not uh, handle the situation because the fire, from all indication, has uh, taken over the entire residence of the speaker and uh, but even with that, there's a huge presence of firefighters and uh, members of the Liberia National Police. I I also saw uh, the the uh, uh, police IG, Colonel Gregory Como, he's on the scene of uh, this fire outbreak. The firefighters are here, as you see, members of the Liberia National Police and bystanders are equally here to see how best they can uh, curb this situation. So, Nelson, can you hear me? Yes, sir, I can hear you. Thank you, Nelson, and thank you a lot. Thanks to Diamond, and thanks to the young lady that helped us as well. Get closer to Gregory Coburn, to everyone you can. Let's try to ask them some questions. Get closer to the building, but be safe. We want to know what's happening in and around the building. 
Can we talk to the fire service director or deputy director? Uh, get get us somebody. Let, let's see what's going on. Folks want to know. Okay, so let me let me let me try to speak to some of the eyewitnesses. At the moment, I see Colonel Gregory Coleman is right here. So let me see the possibility of speaking to him. I'm going to try to find the head of the Liberia National Fire Service. So he's also yeah. on the scene here. Yeah, uh, but there's a little Coleman tension here. here. Yes, sir. So there's a little tension here. So I see the police IG is trying to handle the situation. And then right after, we will uh, establish, you know, uh, a conversation with. Uh, Uncle Sam, Uncle Sam, this is not going anywhere anytime soon, man. Seriously. Uh, I'm serious, Uncle Sam. Yes, sir. Are you there? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Okay, so uh, I want to see if we can speak with the police IG. Come on, come on, come on. This is school TV. You are live, so you want to talk to us? Okay. So, uh, yes, we just we just try establishing contact with him, but he said he's, he's not in the position to speak now. Okay. It's kind of tense, man. It's a little. It, 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 this is the speaker. It's sad. It's sad. This is the speaker of the Republic of Liberia. That's his president. No one is safe. No one is safe from what is going on. This is terrible. Uncle Sam, are you seeing that fresh red smoke? Uh, yeah, for fire the blazing. When I said they don't have enough water, they don't have enough water pressure, they don't have of they don't have materials to extinguish the fire. So even if they pour water on it and it just sees smoke, the smoke is also going to turn back into fire. You know, you need to have a lot of water continuous, and you need to have some continue to put the fire out. So even, even if you just put the flames out, you're not putting the fire out, you just put the flames out. You got to make sure that that no embers coming from there to make more fire. So it, it, it is clear that the fire service does not have the capacity to, to uh, fight this fire or any kind of serious fire in the country, definitely. So all of these things here, we have to take politics out of it. We have to really uh, get investigators, find the root causes are, and then what recommendations and what resources we can put into place to ensure this doesn't happen as often as it's happening. And there will always be fire center, but the but the frequency of these fires, that's the troubling thing. The frequency. You know, I mean I, I, I lived in New York as a young man and saw a lot of fires, but not even in New York like this, you know. I mean, you know, I mean I, I, it was it, this is just this is just beyond the pale. I mean every single day a major fire. You know, it, 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 this is just too much. And, and, and people need to, you know, put in measures to investigate and we, we need to get recommendations on how we can solve it because the fire is still on. It cannot be quelled. Apparently, the fire is on. The fire is on. The, the fire, fire is on. Yeah. 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 And one of well, the things I'm worried about, Stanton, I'm worried about, I mean, the LMP has to make sure that they, they protect the house because Liberians, let's face it, man, because of poverty and dysfunction, some people could be like prone to go start looting. But uh, Uncle Sam, luckily for him, luckily for him, this is the Luckily for him, luckily for him, he very very good to his neighbor. Very very good to his neighbor. Okay. The chief of protocol in the office of the speaker. The chief of protocol in the office of the speaker just confirmed to us that the speaker is alive, he's okay, he uh, survived the situation, and there's absolutely no casualty at the moment. So uh, we are going to speak to some eyewitnesses as well. We are going to try as best as, uh, as we can to uh, bring the view of some of the eyewitnesses, some of the folks who were here when this very fire situation uh, started.
Uh, Granny, though, I, I know th th this is that we cannot say this is new anymore. This is not a new thing. Uh, you know, Uncle Sam was mapping up West Point, Balanceville, Stephen Tower, Ashley, all the places, St. Joseph property. Yeah. And here we are with the speaker. I'm concerned about the documents, state documents, state classified information. You know, some of this thing can be, trust me, he got a whole mushrooms, he got offices in there. Yeah. How many some of those things are burned? Yeah, I, and I think too, I think they just really, if there is any, any inch or if there's any inclination on what caused this, they need to go after it aggressively. I don't think this is, this is the time to have polit political sentiments on this because this is serious. This is now a serious problem in Liberia. People can can connect it to whatever they want to connect it to, but it, the fact that this is continuously happen, happening, it needs to stop. It's it's just, it's so bad. It's just so, so bad to see this and see that we, are, we, we have not been able to successfully uh, stop somebody's house from burning in the last fires we've seen. We have not been able to do that. So clearly, we Hello. don't have the capacity. Yeah. And, it, and Glenny, it's been burning for, it's what, been what, what for several it hours now. now. It's several hours. Yes. Several hours. Go ahead, Nelson. Tell us about what you know about this incident. Do, do, do you, uh, can you uh, uh, oh, tell yeah. us what That's the wife. That's the wife. Yeah. I think you can see something burning right now. Okay. So I don't think this is the time to give an interview to you. Okay. So, like, respectfully, I'm just trying to deal with She's trying to focus. What's going on? She cannot take you an interview, Uncle Sam. She's right. Okay. Thank you so much for coming to Spoon TV. So, folks, this is where we are. We just spoke wow. with the wife of uh, the speaker. That was the wife of uh, speaker. Kofa, that Dama, she right? just confirmed to us Dama. that uh, they were lying in their room when this incident occurred. But at the moment, uh, there hasn't been. Can, 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 you, can you hear me? We can hear you a little bit. Uh, uh, go ahead, Nelson. You try and go ahead. So we are still here. Uh, let's see if we can. Mad folks, I want to say the Well, the fire service can go for water and come back. Yeah. yeah because, because, because there's no fire hydrant. You need a fire hydrant. You need a fire hydrant to get, I mean, lots and lots and lots of water you need. I mean, tons and tons and tons of water. They, 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 uh, the fire truck holds a limited amount of water. So when the water finished, they got to go get some more water. That's just the way it is. There, there are no fire hydrants. No fire hydrants, Santa. I, I mean, Uncle Sam, though, Glenny, let me be frank, man. Let me be serious here, man. This is Liberia we are talking about. Um, where are we? I mean, the people rooms burning like crazy. Crazy. Everything is just going like, come on. It's hard not to put politics in this thing, though. I know you're selective politics. Like, it's hard not to put politics in it. I mean, you don't want to, you want, you want, you, I mean, you just have to be go with whatever you think uh, for right now because you don't know what's the cost. People can, there are one or two people who's even texting me and say, why, why the speaker house? Could this be related to the fact that on Monday here, Yomli Kanga is going to come up with the, present the, whatever to President Boyka. I mean, there's so many in the windows coming out now, but it should not be happening to anybody. This should not be happening. And if it's, if it's an electrical problem, then that needs to be fixed. Because how many other homes will get burned because of an electrical problem that we have not fixed? But, but since, Glenn, let me just tell you something, right? This house is a well-built house. Yes. And there's no way that Speaker Fonati Kofa will use cheap electrical wires. That's what I'm saying. House. It cannot be. It cannot be. It cannot be, be an electrical problem. That, that, that cheap wire. No. It cannot okay. be. 
So there was some there was some root to this thing here that and and I heard money captain say the other day you got people were not putting a problem. Money captain, money captain, and the cause of these things that happen. Stand up. If we have to put there was saying stand up. Money captain, they were saying that the that the breakers to the houses could not you know act like a transformer to slow down the current coming to the house but that cannot happen at the speaker's house no it cannot it cannot happen at the speaker's yes, house it's not just an ordinary person this is somebody exactly. who's you know? outside, who yeah. has swings outside of liberia yes it's not gonna be a build a mediocre building yes it's not going to happen. Yes. yeah but Benny, they did look at that building look at that building that building is not hungry no that building is not testing. Look at that building. That building is fortified. It is not just any it's kind of well built. building. They have to, they have okay. to Where are else. we with this? Okay, okay, listen now. We have never heard anything about fire incident coming up as things that need to be addressed. But this government, am I making a mistake? Have you guys heard anything? Have you guys heard anything that we address this issue? We we'll put things in place. Nothing, nothing. Money captain come and sing his own song and go. But anyway, we can have this conversation or more because today is when I take over. A few weeks went by. It was why Sir Joseph. Who knows who next? Who knows who next? Is it an intentional act being done, Uncle Sam, by somebody? Yes. No, 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 no. I don't, I don't, I don't. I would say we are all speculating, though. Yeah, I'm we're just speculating. speculating yet. No, but I mean, I'm I saying, say. I mean, I, I don't, I don't think so. I, I really don't think so. Look, um, Fanati doesn't have any enemies that, that, that I know about. But oh, also, we, don't, don't, we don't know that. I disagree with you. We don't know. I know him. I'm very close and intimate with him. Even Jesus Christ got enemy. That's true. That's true. Yeah. You can't That's say true. that. You also I'm have the responsibility. Another, another the, two. The, the probability of an arsonist doing this job is highly unlikely. That's my that's my that's my opinion. Okay, the man is at peace with his neighbors, and he, he has he I'm built himself. But you also say that you also have to recognize that seventy seventy years seventy years old man Jesus Christ yeah. came while he didn't seek. Brought you. back a dead man, raised a man that couldn't walk. Put him on his feet, open the eyes of the blind. Yet still he was so for 30 pieces. Every good thing he did, they still sell him, they crucify him. Then who is for that tea? Thank you. Come on, Uncle Sam. I mean, I you mean, gotta, this you gotta is look at all the different, you gotta look at all the different tourist center. For Nati Kofa is a sedition. He's been working closely with Yombi Ganga Lawrence. He's been working with the president. We're not talking war and economic crimes quote. They're supposed to present the documents to the president tomorrow. We can go into different theories. We can say it's an arsonist that's doing this. We can say it was electric. We can say so many different things. We just we just don't know what the cost is to be able to to, yeah. to eliminate. Yeah, but I don't want us to do any kind of speculation, which I would consider like a little bit off. And I don't want to use a word like madness, but but we but you can also say you can also say that Fonati has no enemies. I, I, you can I, I, also I, say that. Yeah, okay. So 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 if he has political enemies, I don't think he's gonna to rise to that level because I know him, I know him well enough to be a consensus. Who was that? Can I can I just come in, please? No. To tell you the truth, Uncle Sam, I, I just want to be a, a Sony Stanton today, right? I think I know they're gonna investigate about Uncle Sam. It just can't. Sir Joseph got stuck in his house, nearly died. For that Kofa, people house got burned, they died in there. Uncle Sam, that something is happening somewhere. Yeah, I know so you I don't want us, I, I don't want to speculate, I don't know. That's what I'm saying. So it's for not that the thing for that thing for that thing is well will come down with the with the findings. I know there will be a, a massive investigation, but it's very bad. To tell you the truth, I can say on the show, Fonati is a cool dude. Yes. He's a nice guy, right? But I still cannot get my finger off it, Uncle Sam. Something just doesn't smell right. No, it doesn't. I'm serious. 
That's my heart. I'm telling you, as for me, something doesn't smell right. It's something, something somewhere, something is happening, Uncle Sam, directly or indirectly. Hmm? Look at the track record of this fire team. It started with the poor people. It going up to government officials. It going up to lawmakers. Mm, Uncle Sam, I can tell you, Uncle Sam, I can tell you something. I hope they can do a thorough investigation. You know me. I know they'll put on LBC and they break up problem. But Uncle Sam, who's next? Who's next? Who's next? And everybody, send them to everybody have a right to their opinion. I think for me, this is a deliberate act of awesome. That's what I want to think. If you look at the building, you look at the individuals that live there, you know the people that build their house, that building is no mediocre building. That is, and you the also want to is well built. You, know where, you, you, you think that Fanatic Ufa did not have fire alarm in his building? That's an impossibility. How can a house like that just get burned if it was not planned and it was not deliberate? So if it's LEC, then not LEC tell us. But until it tell us, Based on what we know, based on what we're hearing, based on the fact that we know why Economic Crown School is they're supposed to present that to break out tomorrow, I think this was planned. Let me just say, uh, uh, unless uh, uh, somebody uh, uh, else says something else. Every Sam, you see how more. you see how she do her own talk. Let bring in Nelson again, Dama, if you can. I see that Nelson on the street. Can we bring him? And uh, in the next ten minutes, we'll get out of here. <laughs> Okay, so uh, we are here. Can you, can you are here live. Uh, we talk to speak to some of the eyewitnesses on the scene. Can you tell us the news and uh, how long you've been here? Okay, Rosetta. Uh, how long have you been on the, on the scene of uh, this this fire? From the, from, from the very start. So what exactly did you see? Uh, what what led to the fire? What what account can you provide for us? Okay. Okay. But but uh, so at what point did the fire service come in? The Liberian National Fire Service. They keep in fire. But there are no water at okay. They have to go back. Wow. Okay. Let's do it one at a time. We're we'll talking to you guys here, right? So you said when. Okay, again, Nelson trying. He's trying, Uncle Sam. Uh, folks, that's where you, you, you it's going to continue on spoon, though. There you have it, Uncle Sam. Let's close the wrap up. Dama going to continue with Nelson. The folks going to follow. Yeah. Uh, but it's good that you guys join me today to talk about the issue. Don't forget, tomorrow we got a lot to discuss on Spoon. We discuss this fire now. It is added. We discuss the uh, CTN and the MedTech. I got a lot of story on CTN and MedTech. A lot of fraudulent activity taking place. And we're hoping to have Roland Guinness from the National, uh, from the Public Work Ministry on the show tomorrow. He's here in America. He's on the spring meeting. He's here. Uh, given the time when it is right, we'll bring him on the show to discuss about the 100 days contracts and non, how you call it, non objection, right, Uncle Sam? Letter single of no source. Letter, single source, letter of no objection. Yeah. Letter of no objection, single source to all this other. My thing about that, and that's my argument, maybe we can just chip on the sense we have but seven minutes left. Yeah. You have the same SSF, you have the same. Uh, 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 or West Africa or something, you have all the same people yeah. doing all the six and 70 years of personal salive, six years of job man we are, and we are still dealing with them. These people that brought nothing, yeah. all right? So we hope to have Roden Guinness. On Wednesday, I can announce uh, that we'll be having Amara Kone on Wednesday by God's grace on Spoon Talk. Amara Kone will be our guest. I want to say to everybody, listen, we have to come on because he's the third person in line of the presidency. Jay Funati Kofa is the Speaker of the House of Representatives. Jay Funati Kofa today, his house is gone. The house that you know to be, they call it the White House, gone in rehab, done, finito. But thank God, Funati Kofa, his wife and his family, they are saved. 
thank God for that. Uncle Sam, let's hear you out. Look, um, this is very this is very troubling. Yeah, and I don't believe. Let's just be very clear that that there are arsonists going around, you know, torching houses in Liberia. I think that is kind of far fetched. Okay, so that's like putting too much politics into this. Look. I believe the problem is coming from LEC because I remember uh, in the 70s, I remember uh, the late Torsi Bernard had his house burned with electrical search from from, uh, from uh, LEC and LEC uh, had to do it. Even Albert Chair, Albert Chair house was burned recently, about maybe a year or two years ago. This is a common problem, but this is becoming more frequent, more frequent. So, um, Money captain, fire service, the police IG, people who understand emergencies, stuff like that. First responders, they need to come together, need to do an investigation. They need to put the facts out there to assure Liberians that this thing will not continue and they are putting some steps in it to make sure that they, if, they, if not, it will, it will, it will, it will, it will be a, a, a catastrophe one day and multiple lives will be lost. So we need to really do something about it as quickly as possible. Thank you, Stanton. You're muted. Thank you. I have a document. I'm going to drop something in the chat room. I have a document from the, the original East International. It, this will shock a lot of people. I went back to dig into East International as to who the owner why did we, this government, sign another contract with East International? Well, because, Ooh. because, Ooh. because, because I, know, I, know, I, know, I want you to hold it, Uncle Sam, because Eric I want us to Obama discuss it more. Eric and Gary are very good friends. Uncle Sam, I want us to discuss it more. Vanny, I'm going to put the document in there. Who signed on East International when it first came into being? Yeah, Roland Gary. Bama, Bama Kamara signed on it as finance minister. Yeah. Judy Moore. President Joseph Yuma Bwaka signed on it as president of the Senate. Judy Moore signed on it. Okay. We can name, and I have the document, the money that was given to those folks that say, y'all go bring 50 some million dollars. Today, East International have done nothing. Jack, Glennie. And we are still giving them contracts. Yes. And, 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 and BK, BK, it's, it's international because that's Kevin Bremer, BK, on that list. And we are still, and yeah. we are still giving them contract, yeah. lady. Yeah. And, and stand up. As, 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 I, I, know, I, know, I know you want to start this conversation. No, no, I'm I'm saying, I, just, I just want to lay this thing. Let's wait tomorrow, Uncle Sam. Ready? Tomorrow we can take Uni because we are bringing in guests. We can take Uni six panelists. And, and I hope people are working, but I hope those that come on, I would not try to jam the show because. I want us to talk to those experts, right? I want us to talk to them. Let it educate Liberians. This thing about public work and national role firm, they are they, they are bad for the country in the sense that they are just giving this contract away again and again to all the old folks that they created. So who is is international? Who been eating that money? Hmm. Who saw on those documents? So the, the, anyway, we have the conversation tomorrow. But this fire thing, Lenny, from my heart, it's a blunder from LDC. Mm? But my heart telling me something just not going on right. That's my own heart. That's my own speculation. Something just not right. They missed that Joseph and nearly killed him. And here you go for Nati Kofi again. And I'm telling all Liberians, who's next? Yeah. Keep your eyes open. I'm going yeah. to leave this for you. Who's next? Really? So I, I think also for me, as for me, I don't think I'm going to rule out anything. Um, and, and when you say who's next and keep your eyes open, I will hope the Liberian people out there, if they know that this is being planned, if they know people homes are being burned deliberately, they need to say something. If you are part of this, this is so wrong. I mean, to even see that, to, to see that the speaker's wife even had the capacity to speak to Nelson, if it was me, I don't even know if I would be able to talk to anybody. 
and for us to watch it live this is this is this is the, for me is is an act of also if lec knows is an lec problem let them tell us if the government has any trace that this is awesome they need to they need to get on it but i don't think right now we can rule anything out because there's just so many things that's happening in the country and that war and economic scrams court is no joke and both yomri Kanga and fanati kofa has been working together so for me nothing goes nothing i cannot definitively say that it's lec and I cannot rule out that it doesn't have anything to do with the fact that these people, these two people have been working together. The government needs to take a stand. This is too much. The senators need to talk about it. They need to investigate this problem. They need to curtail it. They need to put things in place. This is terrible. But how many, how many houses should be burned? Yes. How many ministers? It started with uh, 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 Chairman Tappe. You remember yes. when the campaign time yes. burned? It yes. says got burned. But how many lawmakers, whom? How many ministers? How Who's many experience yeah. before we speak on the fire issue? How much your house was burned to one time? I think a few years yeah. ago, how much your house was burned? Before we speak on this fire issue. Yeah. So what are we waiting for, Mr. Fire Director? What are we waiting for? How many, you know what, let me keep it for the more. My yes, eyes it's terrible. No, thank you. It's that terrible. one? You won't come up that way. I know you got to do your okay. thing. Thank you, Glenny. Okay. okay. Uncle, Sam, Uncle Sam, let's talk when you when we get off. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That, let, let's talk when we, when we get off, Uncle Sam. Okay. Dama, are you with us? Yes, I'm here, Chief. I sent you a message if you can uh, look at it. Oh. A big message. You see, you sent me a message. I can see you. Sure, you know, you can get thousands of messages in one minute now. Yeah, but you gotta reset it now. I'm not saying that seriously. I didn't know your last message you sent. So what was it? I mean, you sent me no message. Say four nineteen. I will tell the person that I tell I text you the different person you text you. No, when not? But, but come on now, we you talking in the Bible, man. Yeah, see you. I come here. I send. I send the message. I got it again. again. <laughs> So is, is there one is there uh, you really you made a decision then we can, we can no 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 that's right man let's wrap this thing up just keep nice and flowing if you want me a few more minutes that's it we do go up and bless up anybody no more because we were all of the time uh we still got to follow up with that story nice and stay on the scene so so yeah so just come on and just keep nice and going live oh uh, i don't know how you would do it go up and bless anybody will be next week by god's grace thank you Damo. i appreciate it yeah so we apologize we cannot bring god can bless anybody this sunday um we we'll have to continue carrying the story the breaking news of uh, the fire incident at the residence of the speaker of the house of representatives Bonati kofa um let's see if we can bring nelson back um nelson kindly kindly unmute your microphone um i see you outside of the residence of the speaker okay so diamond are you there can you hear me yes Yes, Nelson, I can hear you loud and clear. What's the latest update? Uh, there's a little bit of issue with uh, the internet to where I am. But, uh, uh, Damo, can you hear me? Is it better now? Yeah, let's go ahead. It's, it's, it's cracking and buffering a bit, but we can manage. Um, I'm asking you, what's the latest update? You've been you've been talking to eyewitnesses and looking at Damo, the Damo, can you hear me? Yes, Nelson, I can hear you, sir. Okay. Yeah, so um, we're still here on the, uh, at the home of uh, the deputy speaker, uh, sorry, the speaker. And uh, the scene is still crowded, Damon. Firefighters are still struggling to handle the issue of the outbreak. As, as we speak, there is still serious fire in front of the speaker you can see the flames through the windows and the firefighters are trying they've uh they've they've, they've managed to get another fire truck on the scene and so uh aside from fighting from the right side of the building they are also trying to get to get uh another truck as you see this truck is making its way the guys are struggling to enter the residence uh, to enter the fence 
So once they can enter the fence, then of course we're gonna have firefighters battling the fire from this end of the building while the other firefighters are at the far end there trying to handle the situation. So this is what it is. I, I managed to have spoken with the wife of the, the speaker. Uh, she said there was no casualty. The uh, members of uh, the community, Liberians, residents of this place, have gathered here in their uh, to witness the situation. Some of the folks we've spoken with told us that this incident occurred. The fire started as early as uh, 7 p.m., somewhere around 6 to 7 p.m. But at the time, it was difficult. It was difficult to have the Liberia National Fire Service coming on the scene. It took about an hour before having the before getting the presence of the Liberia National Fire Service here. So uh, this is what the situation is. Diamond, we want to speak to some of the eyewitnesses here. We want to try to talk to some of the people who were on the scene when uh, this particular situation started. Can you hear me, Diamond? Yes, Nelson, I can hear you. Before you start speaking to eyewitnesses, my question to you yeah. is, how many fire trucks have you seen trying to intervene by bringing water to that particular scene? I know we've gotten information that the Liberia National Fire Service is being aided by the LPRC fire detachment and also private truck owners, water truck owners are also trooping in. Uh, with, with their trucks as well. Yes. As far as the fire service trucks, Nelson, how many other trucks you seen there coming with water are the residents of Speak of Fonati Kofa? Okay, so, uh, Diamond, if you can hear me, uh, then let me just come in with this. As you know, the Liberia National Fire Service has four engines that are actively running in the country. And... Uh, of the four engines, of the four engines that are that are that are, that are here, um, there are three engines that are actively working according to the head of the Liberia National Fire Service in an interview that was conducted quite recently. So, uh, um, as we speak, right before us here is one of the engines beating right there, and uh, on the far end here you have the engine. This is another engine beating right here. And if you went further down, there's another engine belonging to the Liberia National Fire Service. So there are three trucks belonging to the Liberia National Fire Service that are here. But you also have uh, trucks that are come here from uh, the LPRC, I'm told, and uh, other institutions that are also here. So they, they're still trying to get the situation under control as we speak. Talking about getting the situation under control, it's been over two hours since the fire service arrived on the scene, according to your eyewitnesses. Um, are they making any gains so far, or are they losing ground to this inferno as it's raging on, Nelson? Uh, there was a break in. Uh, you you want to restate the question? My question is, with all of the efforts put in mm -hmm. by the fire service and, and other um, agencies that are helping in making sure they can quench this fire, are they making any gains so far? Are you seeing the inferno um, being, um, being um, quenched to some extent or is still raging on and they still have a huge tax ahead of making sure that they can, if not, um, put this fire out, but at least curtail it until they can do so. Any gains being made? Wow. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm actually struggling to get you, Diamond, but uh, I, 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 if I heard you right, I think your question is whether the Liberia National Fire Service have made significant progress in quenching yes. the fire. Was that your question? That's my question. Oh, yeah. So uh, that, that's, exactly, that's exactly what the situation is. Because I, I tell you, Diamond, when I got on the scene, uh, initially, the entire front of the building you see right before us here was in flames. And uh, the truck right here managed to have addressed the situation from the front of the building. You had another truck at the side, you know, at the right angle of the building trying to uh, handle the situation. So at the moment, just like you see right before us here at Diamond, uh, the Liberia National Fire Service have managed to quench the fire from this very angle of the building. But what remains a challenge is, is uh, the the left angle of the building where you see the smoke coming from there. And that's the reason why 
you have the, the, the truck that just got on the scene managing to enter the fence from that side so they can uh, 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 start to fight the fire from that end. But from this angle, the Liberian National Forest have made significant progress in quenching the fire from this very end. I'm told right before us there is uh, 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 the, the closet of the, 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 the speaker. That place was inflamed just a while ago. And as we speak now, the situation has been calm. There's no coming from there. The fire is off in that particular portion of the building. But what where, uh, the folks are still trying to battle the fire now has to do with the other portion, uh, the, 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 the left angle of the building facing the home of uh, the former President George. We are here in rehab. Any salvage operations still ongoing? Are you seeing them still salvaging materials from the house, like documents, furniture, and whatever it is they can get out of the building, or no one is making an entry again? No, Damon. Um, the, the, the folks were trying to do so when I got on the scene. Initially, they were trying to do so. And uh, as you see right before us here, So as you see right before us here, Diamond, uh, let, let me just try to provide some light. So these are a few of the items that uh, the folks try to get out of the But I'm told that up to 75% of what was in the building uh, was gutted by the fire. And uh, this is just a few of what uh, residents and, and some bystanders and some of the folks who came to help the situation were able to get out of the building. So this, this, this is the situation. And like you see right before me here, uh, just a few, you see uh, some chairs and, and, and I see some speakers and uh, just a few of other things that the folks who uh, lay their hands on, that's what they could get out of the building. Okay, Nelson, um, we have to leave you there. Um, you, Denise, and the rest of the team can continue the coverage on school TV. We have to end this massive broadcast. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Okay, thanks a lot, Damon. Thank you. Thank you so much. Nelson Fuller there at the residence of Speaker Jonathan Fonati Kofa. Uh, located in rehab a marvel of a building is stood you know as the people argue that that was the most beautiful uh, building in the entire rehab that is a building to marvel at just opposite the residence or the intersection the private lane leading to the residence of president george manning we are you have that big structure white beautiful building that today we're seeing gutted by fire where we saw um, people using the water from the pool you know in an attempt to quench the fire similar incident we witnessed a couple of weeks back at the some weeks back at the residence of Montserrado county senator sir joseph and we've been having fire incidents all across the country sparing no one based on your social or political status in the country today we're talking about the third most powerful man in the republic of liberia his property worth millions if not hundreds of thousands millions of dollars they're going up in flames anybody irrespective of who you are in society that is not something you want to see happening is this the wake-up call you know for us to invest more in our fire service you know that it has been happening to ordinary liberians fire here fire there fire here fire everywhere what's happening you know people will say is the lec the surge in the current people come up with different theories but at the end of the day we should also be looking at personal personal safety measures fire alarms smoke detector you know um fire extinguishers a lot on the national level training more fire servicemen having the fire service decentralized zona depot for the liberian national fire service community involvement for the liberian national fire service and a whole lot can be done including enforcement how we construct buildings what type of wires we use inspections so cheap is expensive there's not a cheap building to put a matter of fact i've been there on a number of occasions that's a beautiful building that you see going up in flames but at the end of the day this fire thing needs to be addressed by the government and everybody else we need to get involved it's a tragic day for the speaker his family sympathizers well wishers but another wake-up call for us i remember years back when we had a tragic fire incident at the islamic school there were talks about decentralizing the fire service all of that went under the carpet the issue of the senator's home 
there was another talk again about what can we do to revamp the fire service again all of that went on the carpet now we've seen that at the, the, the speaker of the the house of representatives his residents whatever you think is happening whatever you your theory is of what is happening at the end of the day this fire thing should be a national emergency i was at the scene of the at the ministry of transport some months back and i saw the liberia national fire service you know i saw the liberia national fire service struggle with the fire there at the ministry of transport struggle literally struggle firemen fainting you know a lot of things happening in the country this fire thing is very very it's very very serious we need to address this on a holistic level as a citizen my people buy a fire extinguisher if you get means install your smoke alarm or your fire detector put it in your house and start protecting yourself from there because at the end of the day most of the time there is no redress all right folks god can bless anybody is going to come your way next week sunday we cannot do it today because all of the time was taken up um, by this breaking news this news that is happening now we pray you know that other homes and others can take cue and we pray that the speaker and his family as they are well you know that they recover from this which is going to be a very 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 traumatic process for them my name is diamond slanger on behalf of the entire team you can keep watching spoon tv we still live there from the speakers rehabs residence uh, have for yourselves a good night and bye bye you got the spoon tv you got a spoon radio to the spoon.